Steven. How are you? How was recess? Good, good. I'm glad. Oh, she did what? Oh, I'm really sorry. I'll have to talk to her about that. We know that it's important to always do our best to share, right? Yeah, I'm sorry that happened. Um, so, how do you feel today? Do you feel better? I know you haven't been feeling too well this week. Good, good. Oh, she gave you some medicine. <laughs> it didn't taste very good. I'm sorry. I know what you mean. I don't like taking medicine either. Well, um, while you were gone, um, your classmates took a little assessment from me just to see if they understood what we've been learning. Um, and remember, we've been learning about the seasons and different types of weather and weather clothing. Um, so it's not for a grade. Um, I'm only going to, it's just for me to see, okay? So um, I'm not going to send it home in your weekend packet or anything like that. Um, <clears throat> so, um, luckily you were only gone yesterday, um, so you're here for all of our lessons, but first before we take the little test, I just want to see if you understood what we talked about and, um, just do a quick little review for you, okay? And then you can take the test. Okay, so remember last week we learned all week about the different types of weather and different types of clothes and activities for different types of weather and um, the seasons. So can you remember some of the weather we talked about? Mm-hmm. Cloudy, right? Rainy, yeah. Windy. Right, and snowy. So those were just a couple of the types. Oh, yes, well, no, those are really temperatures, um, hot, warm, and cold. Remember, we learned that different types of weather feel differently, and that means that it's a different temperature. So, do you remember anything about temperature? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. And what do you use to measure the temperature? Right, a thermometer. And when the, we said when the liquid in the thermometer rises up, what does that mean? Right, it's getting hotter. And when it's going down? Right, it's getting colder. Okay, so um, there's also certain things we can do and special clothing we wear during certain weather, right? What about snowy weather? Mm-hmm. Coats and gloves. Yeah, we wear coats and gloves. Uh-huh, and we can build snowmen. And what does it feel like? What's the temperature? Right, it's very cold. Okay, and uh, what about the seasons? Do you remember the four seasons? Right. Winter. Very good. Uh-huh. No, actually, that's spring. Right, okay. So, winter... Spring, winter, spring, summer, fall. You're right. Okay. We also talked about, let me just look at my notes here. Um, okay. So we have winter, spring, summer, and fall. Do you know what are some activities we talked about that you can do during the different seasons? What about in the spring? Mm hmm Yeah, we talked about when, remember, that the flowers you can plant to start to grow and they sprout? Mm-hmm. Yeah, good garden. And what does it feel like in the spring? Is it warm, hot, cold? Right, it's getting warmer. And then by the which season is it really hot? Very good. In the summer... And what sorts of things do we do in the summer? Remember, we're usually not in school. Uh-huh, the 4th of July is in the summer. Right, and we saw those pictures of the fireworks. Mm-hmm, you can swim in the pool. And what's some types of clothing we wear in the summer? 
Would you wear a heavy coat and gloves? You're right, no. Flip-flops or shorts, something so that we can keep cool. Right. Okay, so um, what about in the fall? Is it the fall right now? Right, it's about to be fall. And remember what we said, in fall, leaves do what? Fall, that's right, in fall, leaves fall. So, I guess you've noticed, outside while you were playing today, the leaves are starting to change colors in fall, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, what are some other things you can do in the fall? Yep, we'll take uh, our trip to the apple orchard, pick some apples. Right? And what kind of clothes do you need for the fall? Do you need a heavy winter coat? Right. Probably not. You're right. Just like a light jacket. Okay. And um, I know that you know all about the winter. You told me so many good things about it already. Um, what kind of clothing do we wear in the winter? That's right. We need a warm coat and mittens. And you're right. It usually will snow. So, um, okay, well, I'm glad you remember that. The other thing we talked about were some types of extreme weather, right? Let me just adjust my seat, sorry, okay. Yeah, what were some types of extreme weather that we talked about? Mm-hmm, tornado, right, uh-huh, and hurricanes, and they're both types of extreme windy weather. Do you remember the difference? Mm-hmm. They both can cause damage, you're right. That's a similarity, but how are they different? Right, one begins in the ocean. Yep, remember our pictures? Mm-hmm. Okay, so um, now that we've talked about that a little bit, let's go ahead and take the test. I know, I'm sorry. Yeah, you can go to music as soon as we're finished, okay? I just really need to do this activity with you. Okay, now remember, you aren't getting a grade, so this is only for me to see. Okay, just do your best and give me the best answers you can. So, um, there's your test in front of you. I'm going to read to you from my blank test. Um, how did they do? Well, I have them here, but we can, um... We can look at them later if you want. I can't, well, I can't, can't show you any names or anything, but we can discuss how other people did if you want. Um, okay, so what's always our first direction when we do an activity? Mm -hmm. Right, we write our name, so go ahead and do that for me. Okay. Take your time. Good job. Okay, so um, I'm going to read you a question and three answers, A, B, or C, just like we do on our other tests, and I want you to circle the best answer for the question, okay? Okay, and I can repeat anything that you need at the end. Okay, are right, you ready? Oh, you need an eraser? Okay, hold on one second. Alright, so, let's start with number one. What is it called when water falls from clouds onto the earth? Is it A, rain, B, tornado, or C, wind? Just go ahead and think about it. Okay, you ready? When it is very cold outside, fluffy frozen water may fall from clouds in the sky. What is this called? A. Rain B. Thunderstorm or C. Snow Okay, you ready? Okay. What is the name of the tool? Oh, I'm sorry. Number three. 
What is the name of the tool we use to measure the temperature outside? Is it A, clock, B, thermometer, or C, ruler? Okay, ready? In this picture, number four, in this picture, the weather is, go ahead and look at the picture for me, is the weather A, sunny, B, windy, or C, rainy? Okay, number five, in this picture, the weather is A, rainy, B, windy, or C, snowy. Just look at it really close, okay? Just think about what you see in the picture. I can't tell you the answer. Just use your best judgment, okay? Yeah, I'll read it again. In this picture, the weather is A, rainy, B, windy, or C, snowy. Okay. Number six. Go ahead and look at the picture for me for a minute. In this picture, is the temperature outside hot, warm, or cold? Now, I can't tell you. Just think of what we talked about, the temperature. Remember our three different thermometers and what they look like? Yeah, okay. Alright, are you, you're, that's your final answer for that? Number seven. In this picture, is the temperature outside hot, warm, or cold? Okay. Number eight. If you were wearing a hat and mittens, what might the weather be outside? <clears throat> a. Snowy. B. Sunny. Or C. Warm your time. Okay, ready? Number nine. We may bring an umbrella to school when the weather is A, sunny. Oh yeah, that's just the air conditioning. I'm sorry if it scared you. We'll start again. Number nine. We may bring an umbrella to school when the weather is A, sunny, B, windy, or C, rainy. Remember, I can repeat anything for you if you want. Okay. You ready? Alright, let's... No, we're not quite done yet. Let's flip it over. Okay. Go ahead and look at the picture for me. For a minute. In this picture, what type of extreme windy weather can damage houses and trees? Yes, I'll repeat it. In this picture, what type of extreme windy weather can damage houses and trees? A. Thunderstorm B. Hurricane or C. Tornado Don't tell me. Don't say it out loud. Okay, ready? Number 11. When we are wearing shorts, sandals, or t-shirts, it is most likely which season? A. Fall B. Summer or C. Winter Think carefully. Okay, you're all done? Alright, is there anything you need me to repeat? Are you sure? Okay, while well, you're all done, so let me have your test. Yeah. Yeah, you can go to music now. Oh, how you did? Well, remember that you're not going to get a grade. Yeah, sure. I'll, let me count them up right now. Let's see. Um, 
Mm -hmm. That's right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sunny, windy, uh, cold, hot, snowy, rainy, tornado, and summer. Wow, it's a great job, Steven. You got all 11 right. Uh huh, great job. Well, uh, do you want a sticker before you go to music? I have a couple here. Mm hmm. I only have a couple left, but I have our animal stickers and our star stickers. Do you want a star? Yeah. I remember blue is your favorite color. There you go. Yeah. Yep. Well, thank you. You did a really good job. Okay. I'll see you in the afternoon. Bye, Steven.